shots fired at an Antioch shopping center in the middle of the day. A 50 year old man is dead and now his family is pleading for answers. You took him not only from me, but from, from his kids, from our grandchildren, from the family, period. Good evening, everyone. I'm Mike Meebeck. And I'm Julie Hayner. It is the first homicide of the year in Antioch. Police are now looking for whoever opened fire in the parking lot of the Delta Fair Shopping Center this afternoon, killing a 50-year-old man. KTVU's Alyssa Harrington spoke with the victim's fiance and witnesses of the deadly shooting and joins us now in the newsroom with more on what happened. Alyssa. Well, that's right. Loved ones called the victim a family man, and they want those responsible to turn themselves in. We don't have no idea because he don't bother nobody. Ursula Morgan fought back tears while talking about her fiance, 50 year old Victor Coleman II. She shared this picture of them together. Family members say Coleman was shot and killed at an Antioch strip mall. His body found near his car in the parking lot. And I just want, if anybody know what happened, to come forward. Because you took him not only from me, but from, from his kids, from our grandchildren, from the family, period. This happened Monday outside a check cash store on Delta Fair Boulevard and Buchanan Road. Police were first called to the scene around 2.15 in the afternoon. The thing happened, you know, right in front of our eyes. So it's, it's pretty scary. Witnesses reported hearing gunshots, then saw a car speed away. I ducked. I ducked and I was panicking and I was shaking like I was having a heart attack and I finally got the man came to the store and told me to run in the store and I ran in the store. I ran in the store and was screaming. I feel hurt. You know, people out here killing each other, you know what I mean? You know, that's horrible, man. First responders attempted life-saving measures, but the victim was pronounced dead at the scene. Police taped off a large section of the parking lot. They were seen collecting evidence. The shops there are also equipped with surveillance cameras. A motive is not known, but Coleman's fiance is asking anyone with information to come forward. Be brave enough to come forward because his life is gone. We don't have him no more. You know? Police say any witnesses or anyone with information can either call in a tip or text a tip. Live in the newsroom, I'm Alyssa Harrington, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Alyssa, thank you.